Welcome everybody, I'm your co-host Toxic G, you know your host, it's King Chris. We're back at it again with episode 3, sit back and relax. So remember, here we go, start the show, cause I'm about to tell you guys that this is getting so goddamn cool. I am here, right here, hopefully you all know me, it's Toxic G. Yes, I know I got a two inch, but please don't get mad at me for that. Just have a laugh. Here we go, you know. This is the Late Night Wim Show, and we all want you to know we hopefully you have a great ass time. So we are worth your time. So just sit back and relax as we have a great ass time. So I'm your co-host Toxic G, and don't forget your host, he will take over now. Remember boys and girls and everybody of all sorts, I'm your co-host Toxic G, don't forget me because I know that you guys don't love me, but most importantly, the one in all that you guys love and praise as your lord, you weirdos, it's your host, it's King Chris. Welcome him to the stage. To have a great time. Thank you, everybody. And come on, Toxic. We all love you. I really love you. Just gotta <laughs> tell you that. I really uh, love you. Backstage kissing question I mark? I love you. Um, today we have yeah, I love you an too. amazing show for you. Um, <laughs> this might be our best show yet. I'm, I'm not even capping. I'm not even lying. So today we're gonna have... We're gonna What's... kick things off with a special guest... Uh, then we're going to go over to anime news to let you know what is currently happening in the anime world. Uh, afterwards, we will be celebrating a few birthdays. And to finish things off, we'll be playing a quick round of Would You Rather. What do you think of this show? This might be this might be the one. This I, I think this might be the one. Oh, Chris, I'm not even going to lie to you. The special guest today. <laughs> Oh my God! Holy! Like, wait, I know he's in stage right now, and he can hear me. Like, I'm a big fan wait, of his can work. Can you keep your composure, though? You need to be like, like, say can again? you keep your composure? Like, yeah, keep hold, it nah, I'm gonna be professional. Don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. F- uh, 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 Whoa! Oh, whoa wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> well, let's. Um, I'm gonna b- 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 <laughs> what? <huh? laughs> kick things off (laughs) without further ado let me introduce our special guest calling him an editor would be a disservice he is a visual artist he is a content creator you've all seen his videos on youtube and tiktok where he turns average cosplays into breathtaking visuals every time he uploads he shakes the world and he's the only person i would trust with making a live action anime he is tuning in all the way from Brazil, the one and only. Wait, do we have to pull him up first? Wait, we we gotta pull him up. Go ahead. Uh, okay, the one. <laughs> I got his hair okay, raised. the one and only, Jalex Rosa. Welcome to the show, Jalex. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome Jalex. <laughs> We're Hello. so happy to have you here. We're such <laughs> huge fans. I'm I'm literally geeking out right now. I can't I can barely keep Same. it together. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in. We're all super excited. Um so we have a few questions for you if you don't mind us asking, because we all know your videos. They are amazing. But we don't know much yet about the person behind the edits and everything. So this is a really great opportunity for us all just to get you, uh, yeah, (laughs) (laughs) just to get to know you better. So I would like to ask you first, um, what got you into editing? Uh, hello everyone. (laughs) I'm Jalex, and um, let me think. I don't know. Um, since I was a child, I I always liked to. I always like to draw and and watch videos and watch anime and one mm-hmm. thing led to another I, I don't know exactly what was the the path but uh, first I started I started trying to draw everything that I could I used to sell uh, to sell some uh, Naruto arts that I made like in uh, nice <laughs> in second grade or something <laughs> 25 cents that's awesome <laughs> <laughs> for 35 cents <laughs> 
you've been yeah. hustling since a very <laughs> young kid. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and then I started learning um, how to edit uh, photos on Photoshop. And then mm. I, I went to another software and started how to how learn how to edit videos. And then I started mm. doing those very bad videos like uh, pointing, uh, imagining a gun with my fingers and pointing and then just making like oh. muzzle flash <laughs> out of my fingers. <laughs> that kind <Yeah>. of stuff. <laughs> and 10 years later, we are here now. <laughs> that's it. Oh my God, that's, that's <laughs> fascinating. So you've been kind of editing and into visual arts your entire life pretty much? Yeah. Yeah, and uh, another thing that I uh, also want to talk about is that uh, a lot of people ask me where did I learn or if I went to university or something like that. But I learned everything mm -hmm. uh, just uh, watching videos on YouTube and I even dropped out of school. So I'm not a very good example <laughs> when it comes to <laughs> the uh, ac academy or something like that, you know. <laughs> Academic that's, life, that's I mean. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I understand. I mean, yeah, I get sometimes, you know, whenever somebody um, gives me compliments about my editing, I always point to you. Like whenever <laughs> someone says, oh, yeah, your editing is really good. I'm telling them, no, my edit, like, look, look at Jalex. That's <laughs> good editing. Like what I'm doing is like memes and fun. But what you're doing is actual visual arts. Like the stuff you put out, it's, I mean, it's such high quality. It's like movie quality. And the stuff you have been uploading, <clears> it's <throat> even being like used in like fake trailers. We've been talking about it last, uh, yesterday. Like you, you can sometimes see like on, on yeah. YouTube and everywhere, like those live action anime trailers and they use your footage. That's how good it is. So yeah, don't, don't sell yourself, yourself short. <laughs> it's amazing what you're doing. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. But you're, you're pretty good though. Uh, you, you do like a, your visual storytelling is pretty, pretty good. Uh, you, you oh, don't have to, to be so it. humble too. Okay. <laughs> Well, I mean, some of my videos are a little questionable when I kiss myself, but we're going to leave that out there. Uh, Toxic, you have a question for Jalex. Uh, you could have you kissed me oh and said that, that that was on you. But anyways, my friend Jalex, my question for you is, how do you choose your projects? Meaning, like, like how do you, like, do you get them from, like, people or do you just go off an anime that's your uh, favorite? It's pretty random, actually. Uh... Uh, recently, I, I was doing a lot of long hair characters because I have a long hair. <laughs> That's what that was basically <laughs> basically the the reasoning behind. I I did like Itachi, um, Silas mm. from uh, League of Legends, uh, Yasuo from League nice. of Legends, also a uh, long hair character, Aizawa from uh, My Hero Academia. This kind of mm. <laughs> this, all 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 those are uh, they have long hair. Madara, uh, Obito was an exception because because I, mm -hmm. I i was i i was trying to do all the uchihas and i'm working on a, a sasuke video but oh uh, nice I yeah i think that's that's basically uh it's pretty random and now i i, I really want to uh just shave my head and do uh saitama from one punch man <laughs> oh my god <laughs> honestly i could say this i could say this before you do that i i don't know i don't know if you have done it yet i haven't seen nothing about you doing it but i think that you should do ace i could see you doing a really oh, good nice. ace uh, for yeah, one yeah. piece i really could yeah, see that i think that's a good idea um uh, <clears throat> uh, as i uh, i was uh talking to chris and i told him that i i wanted to start doing trailers uh so uh, uh, longer videos uh, with more scenes and more characters uh so i think that that would be a a, a good idea to to put one piece on one of those creations uh have you, um, like, for I, sure. I saw you do, uh, you did a lot of, like, you tried to do all the Uchiha's. Um, mm -hmm. Is is Naruto kind of, like, your, your favorite anime? Or have you, like, what anime are you currently watching? Uh, currently, um, I don't know. Uh, there's an anime called, uh, wait a second. Gee, what's the name of the anime? Villain Saga. Villain Saga, right? No worries. Okay, uh, uh, I, I'm watching. I'm watching Villain Saga. It's uh, an anime. Nice. Uh, I yes, don't know yes, if you guys yes, watch yes. it, but um, uh, recently I'm I I am i am not watching a lot of animes, but I, I don't think that Naruto is my favorite one. But it's one mm -hmm. of the 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 most uh, that I watched when I was a child. So it's it was 
Of course, it is one of my favorites, but I don't know if it's my favorite because mm -hmm. I like <clears throat> Attack on Titan too much. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. <laughs> it is so good. I cannot <laughs> wait for the uh, for the last season, so to speak, or the second part of the fourth season, whatever yeah. they call it. Me too, me too. Yeah, so, um, yeah, let me, let me quickly ask you. So, uh, as I said before, the quality of your videos is just... It's crazy. And I cannot imagine like how much work you put into those. But maybe you can walk us a little through your like your workflow if you have one. And how mm -hmm. long does it really take for you to create one of those like 20 to 30 second clips you upload? Uh, uh usually it takes me about a month <laughs> to, to do this. Oh those my goodness. <laughs> because, oh because, my god, that's so <laughs> <laughs> because, because I uh in the beginning I used to do a lot of the, the parts by myself. So um I had to first select the character, then do a uh, concept art which ba which is basically just draw what I think of my, uh, of the, what I think the idea will be for the the video, mm -hmm. and then do an animatic, which is basically just the concept art but with movement. So I know, uh, oh, I have to do a jutsu here, and then uh, uh, mm, Susano will okay. appear here and there, and then mm. I record myself. Uh, also, I I had to do the costume, and then uh, record myself, and then. Uh, and then start doing the background and then start transforming myself so I look more like the character than do the 3D hair. Uh, so it's a lot of steps, but... Um, oh, wow. But, but uh, most of them are on photo, uh, Photoshop, Blender, which is a free uh, 3D software. And yeah. and after that, after After Effects, mostly. So these three programs. Mm -hmm. Also one, it's, uh, one, one that is called Ibisync. Uh, usually, uh, usually mm -hmm. I use it just to, uh, you can draw in one frame of the video and then the program, the software already uh, just kind of drags the, uh, the image, uh, puts movement on, on the image based on the video basically. So I can transform myself into right. a character, uh, put the scars, put, put some details and then use the software and it becomes a video kind of. <laughs> so it's crazy. So... so <clears throat> wow. So do you actually like I've always been asking myself and talk so you can you can take the next uh, next question. But this is like I, this really interests me. So the costumes you make, you of know, course. in the beginning of your videos mm -hmm. is like I, I see you doing them and like actually building the costumes. But then you like paint yourself into your program kind of. So is mm -hmm. the costume like do you really need the costume like as a reference or what do you need the costume for? Yeah, uh, if I have the costume, uh, it's much easier to to create the 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 other parts because I already have like a very good idea of the the, the how how the light will interact with my body. Right. How, oh, so okay. So I I need the the costume, the base costume, even if it is just a uh, just a very simple base, so I can start working mm -hmm. working with that. But yeah, sometimes the the costume is not necessary if I if I I don't know if I for example if I use the an armor that cover most of my my body I wouldn't uh, mm -hmm. need uh, to do a costume I could do it in 3D but if I had the the opportunity mm -hmm. to to make a costume or or whatever I would probably do it because it's much easier so just to give you an idea if I would do a, a costume in 3D I'd have to model it. Uh, then uh, apply texture. All, all these steps mm -hmm. is probably took like uh, two to three days uh, minimum. Oh, so uh, model it, then texture, then then yeah. animate it to follow my body, then render, then post effect. So it's very. Oh uh, God. <laughs> it's very. It's takes so a lot of time. Work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But we really appreciate the work you're putting in. Toxic. You you can take it away. I think we we are on the last <laughs> question. We are. Um, so, what are you, are you currently working on anything right now, or like do you have plans to work on anything? I kind I feel like you kind of answered mm -hmm. that one earlier when you were saying you wanted to make mm -hmm. movie trailers. But just yeah, asking. I'm working on. Um, I'm working on uh, a female transformation. I'm going to transform myself into actually two females, <laughs> but I, I I I can't talk about that yet. Uh, but I'm also okay. <laughs> uh, working on uh, working on uh, Sasuke transformation. I can even show you guys oh a little bit God, of it. Nice. And 
and also um yeah i don't know after that i probably maybe i would do loki and then starting start trying to do movie trailers like uh Naruto the movie or something like that just just to see what happens Whoa, uh, but I probably I probably awesome. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll probably try to 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 um, partner with more artists so I can do that faster and also improve the the, the quality uh, with more people who specialized on the other stuff um, yeah I can show you a little bit of the Sasuke one you one question <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah can i ask you one question actually yeah what is your favorite waifu, <laughs> favorite waifu. that's a good question that's a good question <laughs> let me think um i don't know i i think maybe uh mikasa i don't know oh good choice uh, good choice good choice good choice yeah i i don't know she's very supportive but when uh yeah, I don't want to say spoilers, but okay. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think... Of course, of course, yeah, of course. She's very course. supportive, yeah, but she can also kick your ass, just so you know. Yeah, if she, if you, if she needs... If, if she, she needs, needs to. to. <laughs> yes. So, yeah. like, that Sasuke video, do you know when that's going to be out? Can you give, give us, like, a release date, mm. kind of, that we're looking forward to? Yeah, I think um, around two to three weeks maybe because i'm working on other other videos too but after mm -hmm. uh sasuke after the sasuke video come out i'll really try to post post more often uh and start doing the the trailers as i told you so i right. think three three weeks probably yeah okay I'll, like I'll i'll pencil that in <laughs> on my calendar and i'll be like like a ch like a kid on christmas day like looking at your youtube and your, and your tiktok <laughs> looking forward to that video because i i can like i can't even stress enough how much i love your videos i i, I feel like you get that pretty much every day but like it's <laughs> i mean that that madara video that i mean the inspiration i get just from watching your stuff because it's not like <laughs> You don't only do like transitions. You could just do like, uh, like, you know, those basic transitions where people wipe the screen and then they're like in cosplay or character. Like your yeah. videos, <laughs> they always have like a certain story to it. Like it's not like you just do like a transition and oh yeah, here's me in cosplay and then here's me like animated. No, like all your videos kind of have like a flow to it. And I think a great example for that is that Sasuke and Itachi video which was pretty much like a tribute <clears throat> almost to Itachi and yeah. like the the um, the brotherhood and the the bond they had. Uh, like, yeah. Do, do you do you enjoy doing that more? Like, do you enjoy like writing out a story and do you put a lot of thought and care into like how that video is gonna play out? Yeah, I uh, when I'm uh, having when I'm creating a video, I, my main goal is to just show uh what can be done and wh how it would look in real life so mm -hmm. uh the the better the, the the most emotion the more emotion that i can put in the video the better you know so mm -hmm. uh they touch ones for example is a is one with a lot of emotion a lot of emotion because it's a, a sad story and also he's talking to 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 sasuke so um uh, i like that that one a lot but the problem is that when I do this kind of videos, uh, it's much harder because I have a lot of scenes, different environments, and right. but I, I really want to try to to make create a workflow so I can do that kind of stuff a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. I think that's that's the goal right now. And you you also talked about like collaborating with other artists mm -hmm. who will then help you mm -hmm. put out more content in the future. Mm -hmm. And maybe also uh, other creators or maybe uh, other cosplayers so they can be part of the, the videos too. So that way I, I, I don't have to be everyone in the video and <laughs> I don't I have mean, to make costumes yeah, for everyone. If, if I, I, don't, I don't mean to like sneak up, but if I can be of any help in one of your videos, I'll be honored. <laughs> also, if you have seen my, do you know My Hero Academia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there's this character called All Might. If you ever need someone to do an All Might for you, Toxic is the person. Toxic, can you give him like okay. a little All Might? <laughs> Did somebody say All Might? Young Medora, get me your pubes.
How does that? Oh my god. I cannot believe you just made me yeah. do that. We, we, can, we can do. He can do like a little, a little uh, all my voice over for you. <laughs> so emotional. So emotional. <laughs> all right. Thank you so much, Jalex. <laughs> we are really looking forward to seeing more of you in the future. Um, can you let everybody know where we can find you, like your social media and stuff, before we let you go? Yeah. 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 Um, it's Jalex Rosa everywhere. Uh, uh, yeah, that's it, <laughs> basically. Uh, so, Jalex Rosa everywhere. It's uh, you on YouTube, yeah, yeah, yeah. TikTok, Instagram. You can find him everywhere. Thank you so much for doing this. We are huge fans, and we're really excited to see more from you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. We love you, Jalex. We love you, Jalex. So Put your hands together for Jalex. Thank you so much for doing this. And you can you can have I'm, I'm gonna move you back on into the audience. I don't know if he depends on listening. He can leave or he could stay. I just moved them back to yes, the audience. You can leave or you can stay. <clears throat> um as we carry but, on. But um the show. real quickly, um mm -hmm. I have to I don't know if you know this, Chris, but fun fact, did you know that uh Tokyo to uh, like Tokyo Avengers was actually inspired by Re Zero and Erased? Did you was know that? Was it really? No, I didn't. I didn't know that. Yeah, that's, that's it, really it was cool. surprisingly. That's amazing. No, I had no idea. Um, <clears throat> speaking of all might. Yes, let me on. <laughs> um, he he wants he wants okay, to call. Okay, no worries. Yeah, bring him. Yes, let me on. <laughs> Cue the music. Fuck oh my god. <laughs> I, all might, and young toxic, are here for another ad break. We want you to know. Then most of you watchers are not subscribing. So subscribe and like, and don't forget to comment because I, All Might, would like to give you my, um. Don't you say it, All Might! <laughs> uh, I would like to give you my. Don't fucking say it! I would like to give you my okay. hair. Just, just okay. my hair. Okay. Thank you. I love you, All Might. I love you too, young toxic. So, remember, we will rise at you, A High. Here at Land of Drip and Late Night Weebs and everything. So remember, please check out Toxic G's 065 YouTube channel in the description. And don't forget about It's King Chris. Subscribe to him too. And most importantly, check out that Spotify and follow so you can listen to it in the car, in the air, or most importantly, on the toilet. It's what I like to do, young me personally. So, it's been a great time. But I have to go because my shit's running out and shit. So yeah. <laughs> oh. Whoa. I, I swear to God, I I can't control him. I, I really. Shut it's up. oh my god. I, oh my! I wasn't. I wasn't talking. No! Give me care. No! Just wiggle here. Go. Okay, I think I think he's I think he's okay. Think How he's do gone. you have him under control? I, th I kicked him out All the right. room. All right, well... Put him in the back. I put him in the bathroom. He he's scared of the dark, God. surprisingly. <laughs> what? That's an interesting fun fact. <laughs> he's, 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 scared, he's scared of the dark. <laughs> That's all I can say. I put him in the back. I lock him in the bathroom with the light off. <laughs> That's all I do. It sounds like torture. All right, but anyways, anyways, anyways. Anyways, that was... Uh, are you ready for this next topic for anime yes, news? Yes, I am. We got some I am. news today. We have some interesting news. Do you want to... Should all I right. do the first one? Do you want to do it? Do you want to do you want to take yes, it off? Yes, I can um, take it off. Bum, bum, bum. Oh yeah, let me let me take okay, it. Okay, let me take I'll it. Let you have it. Um, so we right. just got a new teaser trailer for the upcoming season three of Demon Slayer, uh, which will be covering the Entertainment District arc. And we, you know, honestly, we don't see much in the teaser. It's like twenty seconds ish. But what we do, and this is like a completely new thing, they have just revealed um, the main antagonist, excuse me, which will be the Upper Moon 6 Daki. So if you remember, we met one of the Upper Moons in the, uh, in the movie without trying to like spoil it too much. And the new season three uh, will be covering Upper Moon 6 Daki and her brother. And also the sound pillar Tengen will play a vital role and he has already appeared in like season one. We've like seen him, you know, very quickly. We don't know much about him yet unless you have read the manga, but anime wise, we have not seen him at all. So he's like a completely new character. 
I'm really excited. We're going to get a lot of fight scenes with him and Tanjiro, Zenitsu, uh, Nezuko, Inosuke, like everybody, <clears throat> the old cast. And they have not given us an exact release date yet. They have said it's going to be released in 2021. And I'm just going to be assuming it'll be in fall because that's usually when these projects come out. Um, but yeah, Toxic, are you excited mm -hmm. for season three of Demon oh, Slayer? Oh, okay, listen, okay. listen. Okay. Hold up. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I seen a fan animation of Zenetsu. Yeah. And the fact that it's so good, and it's not even made by the studio. Was it Jalex? I am so hyped. No, it wasn't oh, okay, Jalex, unfortunately. That, dude, if, Zen if Jalex were to dye his hair <laughs> yellow and do Zenetsu, <laughs> like, specifically, specifically the scene... From the Mugen Train movie oh. when they were in the train, I think it would be so dope. Dude. Oh my god! When he protects Nezuko, oh my god! Um, Sploosh. Oh Sploosh. my god! Holy! I'm ho! Oh. Oh. oh my! Get back in the <laughs> My bad. He got he got excited too. Apparently, dude, I'm so. But yeah, hyped. I think I think that this is gonna be so hyped I up. Know. I hope. Listen, I'm gonna say this though. Uh, it's overhyped. What? It's a it's a great show, and I'm really hyped for it. But it's too overhyped. <sighs> Everybody's always like, oh, it's the best anime. It's oh, the best yeah. Anime. I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. It's a great anime, but it, I can I can tell you that I don't think it's the best anime. It's a it's a great anime, but I, I can't live with yeah, it. Yeah, true. I mean, I don't think it's the best <clears> either. It does have really amazing animations, which is, I think, what has been, you know. I mean, the story and all is great. We don't know much yet, but the animation is just what stands out, I think. It's, it's what makes Demon Slayer so rememberable. <clears throat> Um, yeah, do you want to take it away with the next news topic? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. So, um, we got some pretty sad news today mm. for those who watch, um, The Misfit of Demon King Academy. Well, the manga artist Kaya Haraka has passed away. Um, he passed away on July 6th. And it's, and it's really some sad news and I, and I, re I, I rest peace for him <clears throat> or her. I'm not sure if it's a guy it's or a girl. Guy. But, um, oh, it's a guy. Mm -mm. Rest in peace to him. Um, the, the, it will be canceled. <clears throat> and long story short, it's about like a guy who's reincarnating, goes to school or something like that with his like reincarnations of his strongest demons or something like that. But, um, it's it's sad that it has to come to an end because this person has died. Like I said, for the for the for the third or fourth time, rest in peace for him. Yes, rest in peace. I want to. I want actually in chat. I, I want to see. I want to see prayer hands or like, or like something to respect. An F. <clears throat> An F. I think that that's what people do. Like <laughs> F F to pay respects. That's yeah. Yeah, yeah it's really unfortunate. Well. <clears throat> It really is. Do you want to take over the next? Yeah. Hopefully, a little bit. Oh no! The, this, cheering this is up a more. little more more uplifting. Um, so the creator of Full Metal Alchemist, uh, her name is Hiromu Arakawa. She um, is launching a new manga. Um, we don't know much about it yet, to be honest. There has not been a title or release date yet. Um, just some visual sketches. It looks very similar. Like, obviously, it's the creator of Full Metal Alchemist, but like just the drawing style and everything, it looks very similar to Full Metal Alchemist, so we can expect to see more of that. Um, it'll be a completely new thing. Um, but yeah, as I said, we don't know much about it uh, as of this moment. Uh, she is most well known for her work on Full Metal Alchemist and Silver Spoon. And the very popular anime Fullmetal <laughs> Alchemist Brotherhood uh, is based on her work. Um, and we're all really excited for her next uh, upcoming manga. And we will, of course, keep you updated as soon as we hear more. And we have one more story for you. I'm hype. Which Toxic will take away. Um, I got some good... F I, guys got, I got some really good noise for nice. you. Um, I can tell you that... Jujutsu Kaisen manga is coming oh back, boys boy. and girls and everybody. I'm hype. I don't know if you guys read the manga or watch the anime, but I am hype because that means more manga, more anime. I usually watch the the uh the anime, but I read the manga a lot. But it's coming back, so I'm pretty hyped for it. Um, I don't have an exact date, but it is it is coming. 
that's all I know is it's really coming back. Uh, I'm gonna try to see real quick. Yeah, it doesn't really give a big date or nothing like mm -hmm. that. Well, I mean, we're, we're all going to be looking forward to it. Have you, uh, <clears throat> you've, so you've read the manga a little? Yeah, I can definitely tell the manga. I, I catch up with mangas. I, I, I didn't ever really used to read manga, mm -hmm. but I've actually been reading manga a lot lately. The only time I really massively read manga was One Piece when I got grounded and I couldn't watch the <laughs> anime. <laughs> so I went to my library and like... Like, I rented them out. I kind of stole them in a way because I never returned them well, back. You still which have I owe, them? like, a big fine for. I still have them. It's, like, a hundred chapters. Dude, your fine is going to be, like, a million dollars. <laughs> it's, no, it's, it's like, I think my, I think they stopped my fine at, like, $200, oh, if I'm being honest with you. Wait, that's a pretty good deal, is it not? <laughs> like, how many mangas do you have from One Piece? Oh, I, I have, I could t tell you at least I have, like, 50, but they're, like, the Vaught. Like they're volumes, so like there's three, like there's four or five chapters in one. Right, book. yeah, it's like so fifty, and I think one manga is like an average of five dollars. So fifty times five is two hundred fifty. <laughs> Someone in chat goes, "I stole the bleach manga." <laughs> <laughs> Man, I mean, yeah, I've not, I've not read. Yeah, but I can definitely tell you that. Mm -hmm. For sure. Oh, okay. So are you ready to get into some birthdays, my friend? Yes, we have some very, very notable birthdays that we should be celebrating. Uh, one happened yesterday, right, two right. happened today. Would you like to take it away? So, <laughs> I'd like to say happy birthday to Tanjiro on the 14th. I would like to say happy birthday to Ichigo and Midoriya. Oh. Young Midoriya! Young Midoriya! Young Midoriya! Happy birthday, Young Midoriya! <laughs> Alright, get get back in the get back in the book. <laughs> Alright. But yeah, these birthdays, these are some pretty good, amazing characters that everybody knows and loves. So happy birthday to them. I actually I'm gonna Can I throw in someone that I might sure, know? Yeah. So listen, I'm gonna tell you right now. Hey, remember remember that topic that I had about that one special beautiful girl that mm -hmm. I know? Ahaha. Her birthday's coming up, so I'm gonna say Ooh, happy birthday to her. Happy birthday! Because uh, ha ha! Whoa! Oh, I mean, I mean, um, happy birthday, okay. happy birthday to you. Hey yo, Chris, I wanna rail you. Oh, uh, I, I, uh, happy me. birthday! Happy birthday, everybody! <laughs> happy birthday! <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think we're good with the birthday. <laughs> <laughs> these birthdays <laughs> always go like uh, do you actually know how old these people are i have no clue i'm gonna be honest i have no Matanjiro, clue i think midori has got to be like five years old he cries too much <laughs> well ichigo has to be like in his <laughs> what 20s and tanjiro is i'm pretty sure he's like 20 22 i think and tanjiro is fairly young i could tell you actually like i think tanjiro in the beginning of demon slayer <clears throat> is like 13 ish and at the end of demon slayer he's like 16 or 17 oh he's like he's oh at the he's like 20 oh wow okay never mind because that's at the end like towards the end mm -hmm. well, i mean there's at the, at the beginning of the show he's 15 then after time skip he's 17 oh, okay, then okay. again was 27 right well i mean no so now he's like around 28 somewhere around there yeah, almost as old as i am no no wait i'm almost as old as ichigo oh, oh my god you're old jeez oh, I'm old chris i thought you were like 20 Oh, I look like 20, maybe. No wonder you always want that backstage kissing time. I'm not complaining. <laughs> oh my Get over here. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm 27. Yo, Chris. I'm 27. Yo, Chris, remember, remember how you said that once you get to a certain amount of subscribers, mm -hmm. you'll cosplay as Pico? Yeah, 69. Or Pico? Yeah. 69 million. You want me to cosplay as Pico and you can cosplay as the other scary oh, guy? Oh, whoa, 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 wait, wait. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be doing... <laughs> I'll be your little Pico. Oh, my God. No, no, no. I don't... I'm going to get canceled. <laughs> this this will be the end for me. If I do. We're going to get canceled. We're both going to get canceled. I don't, I'm not looking... All right, well, all right, all right. All right, we'll just, we'll just forget about it. Are you ready for Would You Rather, Chris? Oh, this is going to be crazy. Yes. So, for our last okay. block, we will, be, we will be playing a quick round of Would You Rather, and you guys and girls have submitted to us uh, via Instagram some very questionable Would You Rather questions, um, with the first one being, uh, here we go, would, so toxic, would you rather have yeah. your favorite anime waifu 
or or boy, whatever you're into, as boyfriend or girlfriend, or would you rather have ten million dollars? Which one? Pick mm-hmm. one. So would I rather have my favorite anime waifu yes. or ten million dollars? Yes. I'm gonna say, listen, I know this sounds so garbo. Okay. I would pick ten mil. Listen, there's a big reason for the fact is oh, you already if have I chose this anime waifu, mm-hmm. what the fuck are they gonna look like in real life? <laughs> like what? Like what if what if they're just like deformed or like what if like in real life they aren't as good looking as you think they were uh, in 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 the don't thing? Don't ruin the And with ten million, what if I were to just buy? Uh, what if I were to spend a million dollars to turn one of these waifus into like a robot like that can do like everything I, I mean, want? I guess. Like think about that. Yeah. Well, I mean, like yeah, I guess you're right. I don't know. I don't know. You don't. Yeah. I mean, if you think about it, all these anime waifus, if you imagine them in real life, I didn't even think about that. They might look a little wonky. <laughs> they might not look as attractive <laughs> as they are in 2D. I mean, we, we, I mean, we look at the fucking live actions and then, the, oh my uh, gosh. shit. Yeah, imagine like Nico Robin, how she would look in real life. Would she still be hot? Okay, okay, listen, listen, listen. Hey, listen. Okay. You can't pull my 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 ho- my honey boo boo up in here. Yeah, but I'm I'm just saying like you can't you can't bring her no, in I'm here. I'm just saying like imagine her figure. She's like super slim, and then she has like she has like these huge boobs. Like I I don't know. I just don't know. Huge mommy milkers. I yeah. <laughs> no, I think I take the ten mil any day. What about you? What do you, what do you think? Shit. I mean, ten mil or pico. Um, I guess I'll be. It's it's a toss up, really. Um. I'll be going for the 10 million as well. Yeah, I, I know I'm going to be disappointing a lot of people, but I have to go for the 10 million. Like, it sounds tempting, but it's just, okay, are they going to be like real life characters or are they just going to be like anime figures? See, I what don't if we know. were to just, just get, okay, but this there's so many questions that this can bring because like, what if we were to go into the anime? Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I might pick the, Ah, shit. Well, 10 million. Exactly, because it's like so. It's I'm just going to stick with the 10 million. I'm sorry. Go with the safe. Yeah. Because I can. I, I, let's see. This is. Then you can picture this. If you like that anime waifu so much, then you can pay the creators themselves, the creators, to draw you a hentai. The creators <laughs> themselves. So it's going to be spot on. Nothing wrong with it. <laughs> oh, wait. Did I just say that out loud? Shit. No, it's. My yeah. bad. No, I'm gonna go with ten million as well. Do you want to take the next one? Um. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, Chris, hear me okay. out. Hear me out. <clears throat> would you rather be in a titan in AOT, or would you rather be a demon in Demon Slayer? <laughs> this is a really question that I thought about for a quick sec when I heard. Oh my it. god, I'm I'm screwed either way. Oh my god. So wait. Okay. So let's set the rules. If if you are a titan in Attack on Titan, are you just gonna be like? Are you gonna be like uh, like an abnormal? No, I think you're gonna have like you're gonna have like the abilities to turn into a titan. Oh, okay. I ter- I, ju- I thought I'm just gonna be one of those like really shitty titans, <laughs> which is running around. I mean, I don't know. They, whoever wrote this really didn't clarify. It, so I, I we'll just go with that only for the fact is the demons are really the demons all mainly have knowledge. Yeah, and titans don't really. So I would assume we're we're just comparing them to each okay. other, which I would personally. Well, you go first. I'll let okay, you go so first. Okay, if, so if I can transform um, or be a demon, I would I would probably pick... Oh, shit. Let me pick the Titan. Yeah, let me pick the Titan. I would pick demon. 100%. Really? I would pick demon. Wait, why? Uh, yeah. Okay, think of it like this. If you're a Titan, mm-hmm. you're being hunted by these vicious killers. Well, same in demons there. Okay, but also... Okay, but think of okay. it like this. Also, you turn into a human and still have the ability to be eaten. You look at demons, and demons can live a natural life. Like, there's demons in Demon Slayer who just live a natural life hiding. Okay. Yeah, unless... unless, unless so, Kanji I could be a demon you. and live a, a normal life other than eating people and be fine. True. Yeah, I guess that's true. I don't know. I feel it's a hard yeah, question because tough. you look at uh, some of the main characters in in Demon Slayer and you look at some of the main characters in Attack on Titan. Mm-hmm. Honestly, it's a hard question because both animes are brutally fucked. <laughs> <if I'm laughs> You're gonna get killed either way. I feel like 
<laughs> like no matter who you choose yeah, yeah like as a demon and demon slayer even because if you're, if you're titan you're gonna have to, you're gonna actually have to fight yeah you're gonna have to fight in either yeah, one true. so it's not really gonna matter yeah well and i feel like demon slayer is a quicker death would be even a nice death if you're like against tanjiro he just like gently kills you off yeah maybe you're right i don't know yeah see but then there's other characters like I don't know. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. It's a hard. But question. wouldn't wouldn't it be I'd like so sick to turn into like the colossal Titan and attack on Titan? Be like fifty meters tall. Okay, but you also look at the characters in that show, and they're traumatized. Their minds are destroyed. Well, I guess. Like if you look at the, two, I'm not gonna say who they are because I can't. Yeah, yeah. Spoiler. spoiler but like one, if you look one. at the two characters, the two characters who transform. Mm. They're t they're traumatized. Yeah. They go through so much PTSD and shit like that. <sighs> well, demons don't have an easy life either. Like some of the demons are pretty screwed as well. It's tough, you know. Okay, but look at the demons who were who were working on a cure to f to turn demons back into humans. Okay, yeah. Those people were just chilling the entire mm -hmm. time. Okay. I don't know. I'm just gonna stick with demons. I personally think with demons would be the best choice. I'll be. Okay, as long as I'm not an upper, like, as long as I'm not, like, a moon and under the control of Muzan, yeah, I'll be a demon. Okay, well, yeah. let's move on to question number three, which is not anime-related this time. It is, would you rather be able to talk to animals or speak every human language? Which one would you rather do? I would be able to... Talk to talk to animals. Oh, that would be so sick. See, this right? is this this is a scary thing. In talking to talking through every language would be awesome, mm -hmm. but if I had the ability to talk to animals, I will know what's coming. S like birds, apparently know when storms are coming, so they evacuate. So you'll be able to know when storms are coming. Um, but there would also be really bad side effects to this, like, oh, there's a spider. I got to kill the spider. Oh, please don't kill me. <laughs> I have a family. <gasps> I have a family. Then you hesitate, and then you kill this spider, and then you're just traumatized. <laughs> You'll probably turn into a vegan as well, because if if you can hear, like... No, I wouldn't. You would Wait, you can talk to, like, these animals. You're still going to eat them? If I could talk to... Everything, everything that I eat is already dead. I'm not killing the animals. Okay. I'm not but doing aren't you gonna that. build like so? Therefore, I, I aren't you gonna build like some sympathy nope. for the animals if you can like share your thoughts? See, this is one thing that I that I think I think about vegans. I respect vegans; they can do yes, them. Yes, me too. I understand yes, too. a part of where they come yes, from, yes. but you have to understand that it's a part of the life cycle. You can't expect us not to feed off of other animals when animals feed off of other animals. It's just a part of the the food cycle. I'm not going to convince nobody. Every time I meet a vegan, I'm never like, oh, yeah, don't eat this. And I respect them. I'll eat, I'll eat salads and stuff like that in front of them if they need me to. It's just the fact that if, if you, okay, if you were sitting there and a bear came up to you, are you going to let it eat you? No. Because it's an animal? Or are you going to try to run from it? Or are you going to try to well, kill it? Well, if I'm able to it's talk to It's the whole point them. of you need to think about things. Well, if you could talk to him, it's a different story. I'm going to be like, hey, chill. I'm, I'm going to be over here like a little Dr. Doolittle and shit. <laughs> Oh, uh, I don't know. Plus, 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 you're gonna get me for me anyways. So if you're vegan or not, you're getting my meat. Okay. Well, well I mean, so I would probably. What would I do? Speaking every language is really tempting, but I would probably also choose animals, just because. Man, imagine like, imagine I can talk to my cats. Oh wait, what if they hate me? What if they're like constantly talking behind my back? Wait, that will crush my heart. Maybe I don't want that. Oh, yo, Chris, f you. Yeah, I imagine them just like shit talking me the entire day. Uh, yeah, I'm still gonna pick the That'd animals. Be funny. I'll pick the animals. Yeah, of course. All right, all right. Oh, this is this <clears throat> is a nutty one. All right. Would you rather have Hisoka or Uchimaro as your babysitter? Oh my God, they're both horrible babysitters. Um. Orochimaru is... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're both creepy. Jesus. What am I going to do? Um, so, Orochimaru is probably going to try to, like, experiment on me. And Hisoka is going to do what Hisoka does. 
I'll I'll pick. Oh my god, <laughs> this is like the worst. I'm gonna pick. I would I would pick Ahsoka. Oh, I, I don't would know. you really? He's such a creep. Okay, but think of it like this. I, I would rather not be experimented on. Yeah. If if I'm gonna get my ass looked at or my ass smacked, I'd rather have that than just like completely just like experimented. Right, true. And if if I if if I'm going to be doing naughty things, I'd rather have it, it in 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 my my. Whoa my, whoa whoa! Ah, you know whoa. what I mean. Other than other than have have like needles and like all this shit up inside me. Yeah, like, fair enough. Yeah, I guess you have to go uh, with Hisoka know. because with Orochimaru, you're probably going to be dead. But with Hisoka, he's just going to like, I don't know. He's going to be a perf. Um, should we move on to the last would you rather question? Gone. Oh, gone. <gasps> oh, gone. <laughs> <gasps> Wait, we're going to get canceled. Oh, we're going to get canceled. <gasps> Chris. Oh no! No no no! I'm gonna oh, have nightmares. Oh no! Chris, <laughs> come here, Zoro. Huh? Can you can you say Ikudani? <laughs> can you say Ikudani? what? Ikudani. But what? Nikoni. Ikudani. Or Ikudani? Oh yeah. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on. I'm, I'm like, I'm actually getting scared. <laughs> um, so the last question is: all right, all right. Would you rather be the main character in a bad anime, or an extra in a good anime? What would you choose? I think I'd rather be main character in a bad anime. Like, what would uh, the fact is? <clears throat> see, this also depends on the show. And like, what do we mean by bad? I mean, just like, like when we mean bad, do we mean like just like a a Kame got kill, like no, just or like, like is in like Blood Sea or like is in like what do what do we mean by like bad? Like some anime you don't like, you barely even know that it's like so shitty. That's like it has like just a few episodes and it's like really horribly drawn. I I can't think of any. I I don't waste my time with that shit. If I'm yeah, honest. exactly. So you're gonna be basically unknown, <laughs> or be like, oh, I, I, can, I got a good. I, if I, uh, devil. Okay, listen, Devil Man Cry Baby was good, but I hated the ending. It was, it was. I was so pissed. <laughs> I've never been so pissed <laughs> in my life at that ending. I, I was absolutely. I was in tears. <laughs> I was so pissed. I was in tears. Oh that's like a whole I, I would rather be an extra I'd rather be an extra in a, in a, in a good so like a, like a those people are just vibing like a do you know do you know Shino from Naruto like the bug boy the one who always some, yeah, yeah like that did you say the black no, boy the, the bug boy the black boy oh the yeah he always has like these bugs he is like from from that <laughs> man <laughs> yeah. Don't wait! Don't cancel me for something I didn't even say. Would an extra be like someone like uh, an extra would be someone like Kobe, right? Mm, yeah, fair enough. Or yeah. is an extra? He, yeah, just like yeah, not even like one of the side characters, just like an extra. So like yeah, like a Kobe or like so a, like a, a just a marine person. Yeah, just like marine number five, something like that. So like sh- sh- like Shushu the dog. Yeah. I'd rather be yeah. Rainer. I'd be a ra- I'd rather be an extra. I would rather be an extra. You're gonna have like like a minute of screen time in the entire anime. It's fine. I'm 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 gonna be I'm gonna be a, um. I'm gonna be the best. I'm gonna be the best extra in the entire okay, show. Okay, so you're gonna be Shushu in One Piece, and I'm gonna be the ice cream in Boku no yep. Pico. So that'll be it for today. Uh, thank you so much, Yo, everybody, what? for joining what the f- <laughs> Thank you so much. Yo, we will be ending. Wait, 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 we'll hold on. Wait, you can't, can't, you can't stop this yet. Wait, Chris, <laughs> did you say the ice cream and Boko no Pico? <laughs> yo, yo, this one's got me fucking on the gr- what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the f- are you smoking? Oh my god, I cannot believe you just- <laughs> I'm not giving the chat! I can't, I can't, I can't, I fucking- <laughs> Oh my god! Why the ice cream? Why? Why? I can't! I got tears in 
my eyes. Oh my god. You know what? You know what? This is it. This is it. This is, this is, this is today's show. Thank you so much. This is. Thank, thank, thank you, coming. Thank you for coming to Late Night Weep Show. Third episode. I, All Might, would like to say thank you for coming here. All right, all right, All Might, calm down. It is I, Dr. Doofenshmirtz. I'm here, and I'm vibing and shit, and yeah, all right, all right. <laughs> Hello? Have you seen Azun on I'm not gonna lie, I'm trying to show her my What's three inch Excalibur, if you know what I mean. All right, all of you knock it off. <laughs> like, Scoot, like, you should totally like and subscribe, man. Already? Like and subscribe? <laughs> All right, all right, all right. All of you guys, get back in the closet. Jeez. Thank you from both of us. We hope you guys enjoy tonight's ending of a crazy episode. Hope you enjoyed tonight's special guest. I hope you enjoyed Chris's ice cream. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I can't. I'm dying. I'm legit dying. I can't handle that. <laughs> but um, I want you to know that I, we love and enjoy every single one of you viewers. Here from the Discord server. Remember, the Discord server link is in the description below. So if you guys want to hear this live, feel free to join the Discord. Um, I want you to know that you guys are all amazing and you guys are all special people in our hearts. And even though this is starting off so small, this is going to rise to the top and grow bigger than it as there ever has before. Yes, and I, All Might, will give you my pew oh, my. Uh, my hair so you can rise and get millions and millions of subscribers so thank you everybody here tonight thank you every single one of you mwah, mwah. chris do you have anything to say no just thank you everybody for joining in just just still <laughs> dying about the ice cream still no, dying no, no, about, the ice about the ice cream, ice cream. Yeah. and um yeah thank you everybody and <laughs> we'll talk <laughs> next week <laughs> thank you so much. like subscribe and share peace, peace. bye everybody <laughs>